Welcome to the School of Love. Today we will be talking about romance scams. Romance scams occur when victims are contacted via dating or social media apps by a fraudster who attempts to foster a relationship with a victim to gain their affection and trust. The scammer then uses the illusion of a romantic or close relationship to manipulate and or steal from the victim. Meet Elizabeth. She is a 35-year-old financial consultant who signed up for a dating website called Love at First Sight six months ago. She met a guy named Ryan a month after she signed up, and it has been going really well between them. He even confessed his love to her one month into them dating. She has been asking Ryan to meet up for two months, and there has always been an excuse to why he can't. Let's look at their most recent conversation. Elizabeth realized she was scammed. Here are some signs of a fake social media account. Newly created account where all the posts are recent. Lack of personal information, posts, and friends on their account, and aspects of the profile seem too good to be true, for example, stolen pictures from other websites, poor grammar and wrong spelling. Here are some red flags to look out for. Fraudsters claim to be out of country, overseas on business, away on military deployment, or other reasons. They fabricate claims of sickness or legal injustice and then request for financial assistance. They spoil the victim with attention and profess love quickly. They want to communicate immediately through platforms other than the dating site, such as email or text messaging. Constantly avoiding face-to-face -face interactions, due to emergencies that they then request finances for. They claim they want to visit your country, but request for funds to pay for the plane ticket. They request for you to carry out fraudulent financial transactions on their behalf. Here's what to do. Keep an eye out for red flags. Never give your financial details to anyone you do not know or trust, especially if you met them online. Be careful what you post and make public online. Never send money to anyone you have only communicated with online or by phone. If you believe you are a victim of one of these scams report it to fraud at cibcfcib.com.